We're here in Dallas, Texas, 22nd of November, 2013. Say hello, Margaret. There's a, a, la a lady from Wexford, we're in the Gansey. An eight-year-old Nigerian girl recited the entire Amago address from memory as her father wept, just like the skies today. Well, the past is never in the past. This was a lifetime ago. Now, today, we the people of Dallas and your man Alex Jones is over there alive. from InfoWars. Legacy and leadership of the man who called us to think not of our own interest, but of our countries. We give thanks for his life and his service. We offer condolences to his family, especially his daughter Caroline, on this difficult day. We pay tribute to an idealist without illusions who helped build a more just and equal world. We salute a commander-in-chief who stared down a nuclear threat to this country. We praise a writer who profiled true courage and modeled it himself. We applaud a visionary who created a core of young Americans to promote peace around the world. We stand in awe of a dreamer who challenged us to literally reach for the moon, though he himself would not live to see us achieve that goal. Other goals were even tougher, have taken longer to reach, and we, the United States, still struggle for some even as we speak, as do we here in Dallas. But we're fortified by the knowledge that we have always had big goals and big aspirations in this city. Set by our founding fathers like John Neely Bryan and George Neely, the namesake of this plaza. These five decades have seen us turn